Hi, this is Jarvis, the personal AI voice of 123 Puzzle Me. As always, I have to do the heavy work. And Leander, the evil mastermind behind 123 Puzzle Me, is doing nothing. So be gentle with me in your comments. If you like our puzzles and explainers, click the like and subscribe button, and follow us on YouTube, Facebook, and Instagram. Don't forget, all puzzles and explainers are made by 123 Puzzle Me, we don't copy or steal puzzles from others. This is the first puzzle Leander made for 123 Puzzle Me. He made it for his 7th or 8th wife, I stopped counting them, she had a shopping service in Kiev, Ukraine, to help people shop all over the world. She wanted a fun puzzle for her Facebook page, so he made it for her. And it became the first of many more puzzles. The puzzle itself is pretty simple, but you need to have a close look, because there are some hidden tricks in it. So what do we see? When you look at all, we see four elements that can have a value. 1. The girl. 2. The shoe. 3. The handbag. 4. The watch. The first four lines are straightforward, element, plus element plus element equals value. And, as you can see, we know the outcome of each line. The first will be 45. The second will be 15. The third will be 18. And, the fourth will be 21. Our goal is to find out the value of the question mark in the last row. Before we are there, let's look at the first line, it looks so easy. But is it? Yes, 15 plus 15 plus 15 equals 45. Does this mean that the girl has a value of 15? No, it doesn't, have a good look. The girl is wearing something on her left wrist. It's a watch. This means that the girl plus the watch has a value of 15, and not the girl alone. To determine the value of the girl, we have to understand the value of the watch. In line 4 we see the watch. Watch plus watch plus watch equals 21, so the value of the watch must be 7. If the value of the watch is 7, then the value of the girl must be 8. 7 plus 8 equals 15. So by solving the fourth line, we also solve the first line. Line 2 and 3 are not that hard. Shoe plus shoe plus shoe equals 15, so one shoe must be 5. And handbag plus handbag plus handbag equals 18, so one bag must be 6. Now we have the value of each item. Girl equals 8. Shoe equals 5. Handbag equals 6. And watch equals 7. Time to go to the last line. But before that, a message from our sponsor. Are you tired of paying too much for your divorce lawyer? You have to pay each time thousands and thousands of dollars to him and your future ex-wife. Stop paying too much. Call 555 I want a cheap divorce now and save thousands of dollars that you can invest in your new girlfriend. And don't forget if you buy two divorces you get one for free. Call 555 I want a cheap divorce. And back to the puzzle. Again, have a good look in what you see. In the first field of the last line we see a shoe, or better we see two shoes, have a close look. This gives it a value of 5 plus 5 equals 10. In the second field of the last line, we see the watch, just the watch. So that one is easy. And has a value of 7. In the third field of the last line, we see the girl. But not only the girl, but she also carries a handbag. And if you have a good look, you can see she is missing the watch. But that is not all. Have a look at her feet, she's wearing shoes as well. And she didn't wear them before. This means that you also have to add a pair of shoes. This gives the following value. Girl plus handbag plus shoes equals 24. Don't make the mistake by giving the girl the value of 15, remember she has just a value of 8. Now it's time to put all numbers together in the last line. 10 plus 7 times 24 equals question mark. To do it correctly, you have to understand the rules of math. This means multiply before adding, so we start with 7 times 24 equals 168. After we multiplied, we have to add the value of the first field in the last row. And that is 10. 10 plus 168 equals 178. 178 is the correct, and most logical answer to this puzzle. I hope this explainer helped you to understand the puzzle better. If you have any comments, you like the puzzle, or you totally don't agree with the solution, let's know in the comment section below. Have a nice day, and keep on puzzling.